Hi, I wanted to add a little introduction to this Stitch Fix video because um, obviously, uh, as you will see, I filmed it back on January 3rd and it is, I believe, the 29th. I don't know what day it is. Um, but I wanted to explain a little bit why there's been such a gap. Um, I've had a few people reach out to me saying, oh, is everything okay? You know, you know, I haven't heard, we haven't seen a video for a little while. And, um, and I'm sorry for that and, and how touched I am by that, that, uh, that people out in Facebook land um, would care enough to, to send a note. And so thank you so much for, for those of you who did that. So kind. Um, and just by explanation, um, I have kind of had some of the winter blues. And um, I have had in the past much more um, significant clinical depression and I have to be really careful about it. I haven't, this one is not that. Um, most every month, mostly hormonal, I do have some ups and downs and I, and I have gotten good at management. Um, I have friends and family that struggle much worse than I do, which is part of the reason why I wanna talk about it because I don't want, um, so few people do talk about it, and I think it's important to know that it's a real thing, and it's a lot of people really struggle with it, and it's um, this particular bout of mine, I don't think was anything more than just the winter blues, you know, a little seasonal affective disorder maybe, um, and I'm doing fine now. Um, but what I had to do is go into some self-care mode, which I've done before, and, and I've gotten good at the management. Um, my the diet over Christmas, the the winter time with the with less blue sky, all of those things, and the stress of the holidays, all of those things contribute. So what I needed to do was to take care of myself and to kind of uh, um, cocoon a little bit, um, reduce whatever stress that I could. Obviously, you know you, you still have to go to work sometimes, um, and there's things that you have to do, but as many things that I can reduce the stress on, including something that I love and care about, like making these videos for y'all, um, um, I went ahead and just stepped back from for a few weeks. Um, I did recently do a lion in post um, that I, I just put up. Um, and for those of you who watched it, you should know that I went ahead and bought this sweater. I'm so happy I did. I love it. Um, despite the cost, it was very expensive to begin with and it was down to a reasonable price for a cashmere sweater. And, and I think it's a very classic piece. And what I really like about it is that it's warm when I go outside, but in the house, it doesn't get overly hot. Something magical about this sweater. Uh, maybe that's part of why cashmere is cool. So anyway, here's my Stitch Fix video. I hope you love it. Um, and here you go. Happy New Year, everyone. I am so excited. Uh, it's the 3rd of January and my Stitch Fix came a couple of days early. Oh, I think it wasn't even due till the 7th. So um, yay, I'm so, so happy about that. And what a great way to start the new year. So let's go ahead and open up this <coughs> fix. Here we go. All right. I am wearing my favorite thing from my last fix. Maybe my favorite thing I've ever gotten them from Stitch Fix. It's this navy blue and soft and I've worn it all December. <clears throat> it's awesome. I don't even remember what I put in my note. Maybe I'll remember as we open stuff up. Uh, it's kind of a big box. I don't remember asking for shoes or a bag. Um, I just, I, I, I remember I have had some specifics, but then I just said surprise me. So we'll be surprised. All right, note, just double check, make sure I still have my same stylist. Hi Brandy, if you watch these. All right. Bag to return things. Oh look, jewelry. I don't necessarily ask for jewelry just because I'm picky and I feel like I can get a lot of jewelry for a pretty reasonable price. And I think kind of the bottom end on Stitch Fix is about 28 bucks. But let's take a look. Mm, let's do that one first. Silver. They always come all tangled up, right? 
See, and while this is very pretty, I just... I, I just know that I can go in and, you know, it's costume jewelry. It's not fine uh, silver. Um, and I know that I can get it at little boutiques and stuff for 10 to 15, that range. But very nice. Nice length. I actually don't have anything like this. So cute. <clears throat> We'll try that on with whatever we get. All right, let's pull out this bundle. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I did ask for jeans. Oh, there's some cute stuff in here. Let's take a look at the note. Let's see what Brandy said. Hi, Marnie. Happy fixed day and happy new year. I hope that you had a great trip to visit your family for the holidays. For this fix, I tried to find some great denim options like you requested, like the Vigo Penelope, Penelope Distress Change. Okay, so I asked for some like really distressed jeans. Uh, I figure if they're gonna be distressed, they may as well be like mega ultra distressed. And anyway, she then she lists the clothes and I'm not gonna go into all of those yet because we're gonna open them. So here we go. Paper out of the way. Okay, first we have just a beautiful sweater. Isn't that pretty? It is a, a trying to think of the description of this green. It's a muted seafoam green. It's got a little, you know, blue, green, gray all together. I don't, it's coming up more blue on camera. It's greener than this in person. But it's lovely. It's got a cable knit detail on either side. And it's not real heavy. And I like it. I hope it looks cute on. Okay, now I am remembering. I asked for, I like the little crisscross fronts on various shirts. And look, I got one. Isn't that adorable? It's a gray and white stripe. It's got the criss crisscross detail. It's a lightweight but long sleeve knit so I can wear it um, on into spring for a little bit. Ah, good job. Okay, let's check out these Vigos Skinny Jagger Classic Fit. And they are not ultra distressed, but they are distressed on the knees <clears throat> and now it's just all about the fit they look like they will will be perfect um, and I like the wash oh there's a little more distressing right there and after this I will tell her no more distressed jeans because really I how many distressed jeans do you need um, at least in my life with my work because um, I probably can't wear those to work. First day of school, there's some girl in the office getting sent home <laughs> from the high school with her distressed jeans. So, you know, I work for schools. All right, so, and then I got, I did ask for some cut from the cloth pants. These are straight leg uh, boyfriend jeans. I think they're boyfriend jeans. They've got the cuffed bottom like that. And I asked for 14s or 16s. This is a 16W. It might be too, eh, might be just right. All right, cute stuff. Let's go try stuff on. All right, I am back. I've tried everything on and you know, sometimes everything's great out of the box and not so good after try on. And that's what we've got here. But it does work well with my resolution of, of uh, trying to spend a little less money. I've, you know, I've done a really good job over the last four or five months of really expanding my wardrobe through Stitch Fix and, and Trunk Club and, and the like. And so I've got a really good solid foundation wardrobe. So now I, it, I think it's important for me to start to be uh, picky and, and only get things that really add to my wardrobe and that I really, really love. So. Let's go over what I got. First, 
is this necklace. And it is perfectly lovely. And it's a nice length. It's a it's got the little clover design, a little shine in it. Um, but for $34, I'm going to pass. I have other silver necklaces that um, that I love just as much and that need of my wardrobe is filled. The next thing is 41 Hawthorne, the striped with the cross front. I really like the top. You can see, and I think I'm very brave, you get to see clothes that don't work well on me that show my holiday weight gain. <laughs> Ladies, the struggle is real, isn't it? So anyway, other resolutions. Um, get back on the weight loss, be healthy bandwagon there. Anyway, I think it's cute, but it, it's not um, flattering on me. So uh, that will go back. And that 41 Hawthorne top is $54. Um, the next item were the uh, Distressed Jeans by Vigos. They are $68, and they fit perfectly. And I think they're really nice. I'm going to have to look at them, think about them a little bit. Um, they do have, in the hips, this thing that I get. I have narrow hips, and most things, especially if they have a W, 16W, if they're plus size, they cut that area a little extra roomy and it is it ends, tends to stick out and be extra material there and I do have that on this not too as bad as some so I will think about these but I'm I'm thinking that between the two jeans these will probably go back um, but I like the distressing and I like the wash all right and then I have this top this sweater, Cable Knit Pullover by Evolution by Cyrus, it's $68, and it's okay. Again, I don't know if it's most becoming. Um, I've got far more sweaters in my wardrobe than I have ever had before, and honestly, far more sweaters than I need in my Arizona climate. So I think that I will probably pass on it. What I like about it is the color, because um, I don't have anything like this. And I thought that I would like this cable stuff, but it's got these big holes, but it almost feels like, I don't know, it, like the hole here and the hole here feel like they are holes and not a detail. I, so somehow I don't like the look of it. <clears throat> and then lastly are the um, cut from the cloth jeans. I kind of like the bottom of them. They're kind of fun. Um, and they fit really well, they're really comfortable. Um, I'm gonna wear them around today to see if they stretch too much as cut from the cloth often does. If they stretch too much, I may size down on them. Um, but otherwise, putting them on, they, they fit just right. So I think that most likely I will just keep the jeans and the cut from the cloth jeans are $88 and they are the Kirsty boyfriend jean. So, so I will probably only keep the jeans from cut from the cloth. Um, I like them. They're comfortable. We'll just have to figure out on the sizing on them. But Happy New Year, everyone. I hope everybody has a wonderful 2018. I hope everybody has a wonderful year of Stitch Fix. And bye, everybody.